हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द ऑनलाइन लर्निंग क्लासेस चैप्टर नंबर थ्री एंड द चैप्टर नेम इज प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ नेचुरल रिसोर्सेस बिफोर वी स्टार्ट टुडे टॉपिक लेट अस फर्स्ट रिकॉल व्हिच वी हैव स्टडीड इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी स्टडीड अबाउट air air properties in previous topic we seen that with the help of the activity we can understand that air has mass and weight why air is called homogeneous mixture because air is a mixture of gas therefore like all other matter it has mass and weight as you seen in this picture you can see oxygen nitrogen carbon dioxide nitrogen dioxide and all other gases are mixed in air let's do an activity take an injection syringe without the needle pull its piston and observe it what do you see you can see the piston can be pulled out easily the piston then remains in that position if you let it go close the inlet hole of the syringe tightly with your thumb pull the piston and let it go is the force required to pull out the piston more or less than before does the piston remain as it after you let it go you will see that more force is required now we will see atmospheric pressure the molecules of the gases in the air are in constant motion when this motion molecules try a body they create pressure on that body this is the pressure of air that we call atmospheric pressure now see this picture we can understand easily atmospheric pressure is defined as the force per unit air excreted against a surface by the weight of the air above the surface take piston on pulling the piston with the inlet hole of the syringe closed more space becomes available to the air in this syringe and it becomes rarefied as a result the pressure of the air in the syringe is lowered comparatively the pressure of the outside air is very high that is why when the pulled out piston is released it is immediately pulled in if this experiment is repeated holding the syringe in different positions like vertical horizontal or inclined the piston is found to go into the same extent in all the cases we can infer that atmospheric pressure is the same in all the directions is there any atmospheric pressure on the moon as you know no atmospheric pressure is there on the moon do you know children under ordinary conditions atmospheric pressure at sea level is about 
one lakh one thousand four hundred newtons per square meter it can be measured with the help of barometer as we go higher above sea level atmospheric pressure decreases